morning everyone! Welcome to our civics class. My name is Teacher Bioli. Before we proceed to our lesson today, let us have a game. Today is you're going to unscramble the letters to form a word. Those who get first three points will be the winner. Community is composed of families living in a specific place. There are different kinds of communities. There are found in different environments. Some communities are rural, urban, near mountain or bodies of water, and wide plains. There are communities that help us meet our basic needs like food, clothes, and shelter. There are also communities that gives people jobs and livelihood. There are factories, commercial and business offices, and mining industries. Here are the examples of community? Farming community. Most farming community are in rural areas and in flat land forms. Fishing community are found near the seas lakes and rivers fisher talks catch or raise fish and shellfish mining community are found in mountain areas like Cotabato and mountain province resort community the philippines is also known for its beautiful beaches and resorts industrial community are found in towns and cities next one is Commercial community. Commercial community are found in business centers. Do you know how many provinces there are there in the Philippines? According to the National Statistical Coordination Board or NSCB, there are 81 provinces in the Philippines. 38 of these are found in Luzon, 16 in Visayas, and 27 in Mindanao. The map of Luzon. Literal translation of Philippines provincial names where you can find land of the swift flowering river, land near the river in Cagayan, the lowlands in Ilocos, land of the enemies Kalinga, land of Queen Isabella II of Spain from Isabella, land the United Lands on La Union. Salt making place Pangasinan, land of Aurora Quezon Aurora, land of Conjunct River Zambales, elongated land in Bataan, land of Manuel Quezon in Quezon, land of rice granaries Camarines, land by the shore Albay, island of full of click beetles Catanduanes. Land research when the rivers are traced upstream, island encountered along the way in Masbate, land of abundance in Mindoro, and screw-shaped island in Romblon of Visayas. Literal translation of Philippine provincial names. Here are land cut deeply by stream Samar, island where the boats are headed Biliran, land of bubbling waters Aklan, Land of Twin Princesses Capis, Land of Large Red Ants Antique, Land of the Nose Like Delta Iloilo, Island Brought Upon by the Struggle for Survival Gimaras, Land of Shallow Water Cebu, Land of Dark Skinned People Negros, Land of Turny Trees Bohol, Land of Dato Ete Leite, Island of Retreating Tides Sikihor. Those are from Visayas of Mindanao. Literal translation of Philippine provincial names are Islands of B Bountiful Waters, Dinagat Islands, Islands of Velvet Apples, Kamigin, Island of Springing Waters, Sorigao, Land of Golden Coconuts, Misamis, 
land where the water flows, Agusan, land of the mountain people, Bukidnon, land of Akuraj, Zamboanga, land of surrounding the Lake Lanao, Valley Fall of Stars, Compostela Valley, the flooded plains, Magindanao, land of the rock fortress, Cotabato, land of brown rivers, Davao, land of the powerful Sultan Sultan Kudarat, island of iron magnets, Basilan, island of ocean currents, Sulu, island far, far away is Tawi-Tawi, and homeland, Sarangani. Those are the islands in Mindanao. Let's measure the length of the straight line down on the map using a ruler. How many centimeters is its length? Now let's use the map scale to convert the distance of the map to the actual distance. The actual distance between Calamba and Santa Cruz is around 28 kilometers. Francis figure out the distances between his city and other places in his province. How far is Calamba from the city of San Pablo? Okay, San Pablo is about 24 kilometers away from Calamba. Wish to travel to Binyan. How far do you think I have to travel to get there? Binyan is about 16 kilometers away from Calamba. Figuring out the relative location and distance using a map is an important skill. This will help us know the characteristics of our community, provinces, and other areas in our country. It will also help us describe how each province and community is related to one another. Do you know the distance of provinces are measured? Maps often use the city of Manila as starting point of measuring the distance at kilometer zero which is located in the Rizal Monument in Luneta. From this point, travelers can trace their journey to any point in our country. Let's keep in mind. A province is an area composed of many communities, towns, and cities. The Philippines is made up of many provinces. As of 2014, our country has 81 provinces. Maps are important tools in studying the different places in our province. The legend, compass, rows, grid, and map scale are important parts of the map which provide valuable information regarding places, their location, and the dense distances between them. Political maps show the cities, towns, and major roads found in certain area. Maps which an entire country are called country maps. Maps which shows the areas within a province are called provincial maps. Location refers to a specific point in an area or map. We can determine relative location using directions and the area surrounding a given place. Absolute location is determined through the use of maps grid. Distance refers to how far one place is from another. To determine the distance on the map using the map scale. For today class, see you for our next lesson. Goodbye class, God bless.